Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Welcome back to Sahaba Sahaba. Shukriya Darshak Amra Khawat Aslam Sunnat Ruzah Shampurk. The Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam is Sama Vesal Khurta. Kintu ikta Amra Allah. Sama Vesal Mane. Iftar Sara Abon Sehri Sara Continuously Khoyadin Ruzah Rakha. Ita Amra Lagi. Tikna Karan Amra Durbolo Izai Mwar Allah Sain Amra Durbolo Itam Shakti Shamurto. امرا تخت و جات خود امرا اون نه حق آدای خود تام فای. اختر روز آسی سرد سام خوی. در رسول حدیث آسی ز آنیکش می رسول الله صلی الله علیه و آله امروز به روز آرخته. تمنای تو ز آر کنود این بانگ تنا. صحابا و منو خرده با بیش از عایشه رضی الله عنها خیلی. تمنای تو ز نار کنود این نار منو خرده بانگ تنا. مت کنتینیوسلی خوی دین روز آرخته. آبار آنیکش می رسول الله صلی الله علیه و آله امروز به روز آرخته. تمنای تو ز آر کنود این روز آرخته. تو آنیش شما خیر بالا لکسه ات آیز خال خواهد دین برا کنتینیوسلی دارا با یک بابی روزا را خا یکتا یکتا سنت آروزا سه سر دسوم داره خو یکتا یکتا سوابور باید اسرا روزا امروز زنی ز آشورا روزا آشورا شما یکتا با دویتا روزا دیرهاد ماشور یکتا سنت آشورا روزا دیرهاد ماشور دوستا روزا من نوی دین روزا دوش دوش نمبر دین تو ایدل ازها ایدین روزا نه آب بیشش خوری ایدل آدرها آگر دینی یا مول عرفا روزاتو بیشش اختر سنت. اسرار رسول الله صلی الله علیه و سلم محرم ماشو بیشی بیشی روز رخت تا اسلامی کلندر فتوم ماش. آر رمضان آر آگی زی ماش شابان ماشو رسول سلام کوب بیشی روز رخت تا روز رخت تا. آمین الرحمن خویسون ایر اختر خاران ز ای ماشو امر آمول نما الله در برای حاضرای تر رسول الله جیگش خورال خارانه ده ای مش خنر روز آرخان بشه بشه ای تن اوتر دیسون ده آمی سای الله در برای آمر آمال نما پیش ای تو ای وابسته ای آمی روز آدار خر روز آره الله کوب بالا فای روز آره خر الله کوب بالا فای تو اخت شعبان ماشو بشه بشه خوری روز آرخ تر رسول الله صلی الله و علیه سلام ای سر پوت تک پوت حدیث ای سر پوت تک شنبه برای روز آرخا ایمان بیش پتی برای روز آرخا ایم کنون کنون حدیث بودبار روز آرخ خر خطاایی سه ایم کنون کنون حدیث جمعه دین روز آرخ خر خطاایی سه ایم کنون کنون حدیث جمعه دین روز آرخ خر خطاایی سه مطمئن مطمئن خطاایی رو خیلی کنون خر جمعه فیکس خورتانا مزبط از جمعه دین رخ لایت سنت آدای اسم سنت روز آرخ شما ها انشالله آن نکن شود جگ عربی استری تو حدیث ها خارجش تا خرمو اخون از ایم ارت امرا امین رحمان رو جست که امی ایم کنون ندیم و ما رو جست که امرا دونر دونر گسته که امرا ایمور تزدینش حدیث گل ازان میتیلو لایل تول بالا آر حدیث. آرتاد شعبانور مدتم شعبان چه دو تاریک راتری فوند و شعبانور راتیر ز فزیلات ای فزیلات شم پر که جشم استو سه حدیث هست. ایشم استو نیا تاینتن کیسو حدیث اپنی تو شامل پیش خورم. آنها خمانه خورن آنها خمانه خورن کوران شیف لایل تول بالا نی، یه از کوران شیف لایل تول بالا تر خودت نی، لایل تول نصف می شابان رو خودت نی. کی تو تاته کیت کیویسه؟ آنها اول امراه خوری دو کوران شیف نی. کی تو حدیث آس؟ آنها خیلی منو خورن. زه لایل تول بالا با امراه باشه جت شب و رات خوی. ایشش مور که شب حدیث منو هد دور بول. کی تو آدای ایت شد تنای. اخشم آمیه ای رو هم منو خورتم. زه منو خوی شب و رات را حدیث دور بول نی. کی تو چطور گاتا گاتی خورسی؟ ایشش مود آنها آنها کتاب گاتا گاتی خوری دخسی ز ایشون بر که آنک آنک حدیث هست گورا اگورا ساندان من چینی شابه شوختی شلی ایمون حدیث گورا شوختی که سه تین تا حدیث شم بر که تو شیخ آلبانی رحمه الله فردن تو خوی راز سهیه سه شما برات شم بر که تین تا حدیث مال بین جبل ابی سال با ایمون ایش ایز از حدیث گوره آل آلبانی رحمه الله تن تان تاین خوردن تو خیره سهی هد حدیس یکلا سهی حدیس اسه شود ران آج جدی دوربال هایت شامای من کنو خارانه دوربال جدی های ات کنو آش زاینا خاران اممم جوک جوک توریا صحابال جوک تری اممم خلی ایلایت ری پالان خوری ایرا تاته کیچو آزاین ها اکت خودا باقی تا خه ج ایرایت امرا گوته خوری کیچو کردم نه زکرو نفل ری اسلام نیومی لو امرا اندیویژیل امرا بیکتی که تو با به خورتم لکایا خورا آر بالا ایرات مشتی دشور گل خورا ایرایت کیتا 
লাইলাতুল কদর যে এত বড় রাইত এই রাইত তো মসজিদ ও গটা হরি কিচ্ছু করা ঠিক না মসজিদ ও গেদার করা আমরা তখন রেওয়াজ হয়ে গেছে মসজিদ মসজিদ কমিটি ও সান্দা তুলি আমরা কই যে এই রাতে কোনো স্পেশাল কোনো দোয়া আমল নাই কিন্তু আমরা দেখি রেওয়াজ হয়ে গেছে মসজিদ কমিটিও একশো যুগে এই রাইতে খালি সান্দা তুলন মনে হইতো যে এই আমলটার আমরা জড়িয়ে নিয়ে বানাই দিয়েছি কিন্তু সবকদর রাইত রসুল সামনে এতে কাপ করতা এবং কয়েকটি সাহাবার হলে এরকম গেদার কিচ্ছু করতা না কিন্তু এই সমস্ত টলের করা যায় কিন্তু লাইলাতুল বারা বা লাইলাতুল নিসফিম ইন শাহবানোর রাত্রি সম্পর্কে যেহেতু হাদিস আছে হাদিস আছে এগুলো আমরা ডিনাই করতাম পারতাম না ইনশাল্লাহ এখন আমিনুর রহমানের কাছ থেকে এরকম কিছু হাদিস শুনে The Mufti said the, the night of Bara, there is evidence for it. And I'm going to try and cover <coughs> some of that now. Laylatul Bara, the night of freedom from fire. This is the night occurring between 14th and 15th day of Shaban. And there are certain traditions of the Prophet wasallam to prove that it is meritorious. That means there is benefit in it. Ummul Mu'minin Aisha radiallahu anha. is reported to have said once prophet muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam performed the salah of the na- the night tahajjud and made a very long sajda until i feared that he had passed away when i saw this i rose from my bed and moved his thumb to see whether he is still alive the thumb moved and i returned to my place then i heard him saying in sajda I seek refuge of your forgiveness from your punishment and I seek refuge of your pleasure from your annoyance and I seek your refuge from yourself. I cannot praise you as fully as you deserve. You are exactly as you have defined yourself. Thereafter, when he raised his head from sajda and finished his salah, he said to me, Aisha, did you think that the Prophet has betrayed you? I said, No, O Prophet of Allah, but I was afraid that your soul has been taken away because your sajda was very long. He asked me, Do you know which night this is? I said, Allah and his messenger know best. He said, This is the night of the half of Shaban. Allah Almighty looks upon his slaves in this night and forgives those who seek forgiveness and bestows his mercy upon those who pray for mercy. but keeps those who have malice against the Muslim as they were before and does not forgive them unless they relieve themselves from malice. So malice refers to sort of bad intent or ill intent towards somebody. So people who have these kinds of emotions, they're, they're left as they are. But the people who seek forgiveness and Allah's mercy, they will, be, they will receive that. In another hadith, Aisha radiallahu anha has reported The Prophet ﷺ said, Allah Almighty descends in a manner he best knows it in the night occurring in the middle of Shaban and forgives a large number of people, more than the number of the fibers on the sheep of the tribe Kalb. <coughs> so the tribe Kalb, they had sheep and, you know, imagine trying to count the number of fibers on a sheep. It would be immense. And so this is the metaphor used to describe the number of people who are forgiven. Um, during this night. Kalb was a big tribe and so because they were a big tribe they had a lot of sheep and so it's just the metaphor that applies in the time. Finally in a similar hadith she has reported the Prophet ﷺ has said this is the middle night of Shaban Allah frees a large number of the people from fire more than the number of the hair growing on the sheep of the tribe Kalb but he does not even look at a person who associates partners with Allah or at a person who nourishes malice in his heart against somebody, or at a person who cuts off the ties of kinship, so to lose your bond with your family, or at a man who leaves his clothes extending beyond his ankles as a sign of pride, so you know, people who would leave their clothes trailing behind them, or at a person who disobeys his parents, or at a person who has a habit of drinking wine. So this hadith is similar to the one before in that The, the nu- there's an immense number of people being forgiven but it goes on to mention the people who are not um, benefiting from this night and mentions people who are not good to each other people who are cutting off ties with their family so we have to avoid these kinds of things 
although the chain of narrators of these traditions have some technical defects, so as the Mufti mef mentioned, th there are aspects of these hadith which, if you look at them technically, they have a few defects. But modern scholars have sometimes rejected all the hadith completely because of these defects, but this is not correct. Our elders have been practicing this, you know, during this night, and the, uh, th according to the science of hadith, the the issues with them are curable, um, it, which means they can be answered by the variety of the ways of their narration, which inshallah the Mufti has covered already. হাদিসে <laughs> ঠিক আছে আমরা এখানে হাদিস দৌড়াই না যে না না সেই হাদিস না এরকম কই না কিন্তু সবাবরাত তো এরকম না এটা সম্পর্কে হাদিস আছে এবং অনেক হাদিস 10 জন সাহাবী এই সম্পর্কে কইছেন এবং কিছুটা হাদিসের মধ্যে দুই একটা হাদিসের মধ্যে যেমন এক হাদিস আলী রাদিয়াল্লাহু তাআলা হাদিসের মধ্যে ইবনে ইবনে সুবরা ইবনে আবি সুবরার কারণে একটা হাদিস উইক বা দুর্বল হয়েছে কিন্তু কি তার লাগে তার স্মরণ শক্তি একটু কম আছে তো এই সমস্ত উইকনেসকে কাভার করা যায় কারণ আরও হাদিস আছে সুতরাং এই রাত্রে এজ এ নফল হিসাবে কেউ যদি এই নাইট এই রাত্রির সুযোগে যদি তার মাকফিরত রহমত এগুলো গ্রহণ করে তাতে আমরা বাধা দেওয়ার আমরা বাধা দিতে পারতাম না ইনশাআল্লাহ এখন নাদিম রেগেস থেকে আর কিছু হাদিস Sayyid Rahimahullah says in his Haqiqat al-Sunnah wal-Bid'a As for the night of mid-Sha'ban, it is a great merit and it is desirable, mustahab, to spend part of it in worship. He adds, however, this must be done alone, not in a congregation. Even Ibn Taymiyyah considered the night of mid-Sha'ban a night of superior merit. In his Iqtida as Sirat al Mustaqim, some said there is no difference between this night mid Sha'ban and other nights of the year. However, the opinion of many of people is that it is a night of superior merit in view of the many ahadith which are transmitted concerning it. And in view of what confirms this from the words of and deeds transmitted from the early generations some of its merits have been narrated in the book of hadith of the musnad and sunan types this holds true even if other things have been forged concerning it among the hadith stressing the status of laylatul bara'a are the following ibn hibban narrates from muad bin jabal in his Sahih, the following, of narration, following narration which the Hadith scholar and edit of Sahih Shu'aib confirmed as sound. The Prophet ﷺ said, Allah looks at his creation in the night of mid Sha'ban, and he forgives his creation except for a mushrik or a mushahin, one who bent on hatred. Haytami said that Tabrani also narrated in his Kabir and Awsat the, with the chains containing only trustworthy, trust, trustworthy narrators. That is, sound Sahih chains 
Ibn Khuzayma includes it is in Sahih, which has the same level of acceptance among the experts as Sahih Muslim, and even Albani includes it in his Silsila Sahiha. Number two, Tirmidhi and Ahmad narrates from Abdullah bin Amr and Al Bazar with the ch with a chain he graded as fair through the great Tabi Al Qasim ibn Muhammad ibn Abi Bakr al Siddiq. Allah looks upon his creatures on the night of mid Shaban and he forgives all his servants except two, one who in intends on hatred and the other in homicide. Further carrying on, Bayhaqi relates from Aisha in Shu'ib al-Imam with the chain of transmission. From Aisha, she said, the Prophet ﷺ stood up in prayer during the part of the night and made his prostration so lengthy that I thought this, his soul has been taken away. When I saw this, I got up and went to move his big toe. Whereupon he moved, so I drew back. When he raised his hand from prostration and f finished <coughs> praying, he said, O oh Aisha, a fair little one, did you think that the Prophet had broken his agreement with you? She replied, No, by Allah, O Messenger of Allah, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. But I thought that your soul had been taken back because yours. You were stayed in prostration for such a long period. He said, Do you know what is what the night is? She said, Allah and His Prophet know best. He said, This is the night of mid Sha'ban. Verily, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala looks at his servants on the night of mid Sha'ban and he forgives those who ask for forgiveness. And he bestows mercy upon those who ask for mercy. And he gives a delay to the people of envy and spite in their state. Al-Azhari said concerning his words, Broken his agreement with you. This is said to a person who betrays his companion and therefore has not given him his due right. Bayhaqi continues, I say this hadith is missing the companion in its chain. And it is a good hadith. It is probable that Ibn al Harith took it from Makhul. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala knows best. A Tirmidhi Ahmad and Ibn Majah relates from Aisha radiallahu anha. I missed the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam one night, so I went out to Al, al Baqi and found him there. He said, were you afraid that Allah, were you afraid that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala would wrong you and that his prophet would wrong you she said <coughs> i said sorry a messenger of allah sallallahu alaihi wasallam i thought that you might have gone to visit one of your wives he said allah glorious and exalted descends to the nearest heaven on the night of mid shaban and forgives to more people than the number of hairs on the hides of the sheep of a tribe of Qalb. Subhanallah, from this hadith we can see that this night is not only a normal night. There is hadith upon backing this night. Obviously like Mufti Hassab has mentioned that there are a lot more other things that we do that are not permissible in Islam but are taken into consideration because it is an act of good deed. Laila tul bala ba shabar kudar ratre. Isham porke ilatre amra kitha khord. Shabar bara ba ratre amra kitha khord tam. Amin Rahman jeshom usta hadis khoy son. Abong thain ekhon ilatre amra kitha khoy mo kitha khord tam kitha khord tam far tam na. Isham udha aro thain khoy ba details. Ar ishob gula bortoman bishcher bara alim taki usmani jara shabai zanon thain lekhat taki thain egula afna jara shayar khora. Inshallah amin. And so I'd, I'd like to start by mentioning the fast of the 15th of Sha'ban. So on the day immediately following the night of Bara'a, uh, which is the 15th of Sha'ban, 
it is mustahab to keep fast. The Prophet Muhammad وسلم, is reported to have recommended this fast emphatically, so he put emphasis on it. Although the scholars of hadith have some doubts in the authenticity of this report, it is mentioned earlier that the fasts of the first half of Shaban have special merits, as we spoke about, and moreover, a large number of the elders of the Ummah have been observing the fast of the 15th of Shaban. This constant practice indicates that they have accepted the relevant hadith as authentic. So we can fast on the, on the 15th. Um, so I'm going to uh, mention some things about what, what kind of things we can do on this night and what we should avoid. Salah is the most preferable act to be perf performed in this night. There is no particular number of raka, but prefer preferably it should, be less, it should not be less than eight. And it is advisable that the parts of the salah, such as qiyam, ruku, uh, sajda, should be longer than normal. So just ex extend them. The longest surahs that you know, you should recite them. And in this sort of voluntary salah, you can actually read or combine shorter surahs, read them one after the other within the same rakah. You can also do your tilawat um, your, and your dhikr. And um, especially, of course, we must remember dua. Now, in dua, we must understand that it is our way to form our relationship with Allah and to strengthen that relationship. So the things that you say in these duas are things that you can think deeply about, what kind of things that you would ask for. Now, there are some people who cannot perform any additional salah or recitations they might be unwell or weak, or they might be sort of busy with other very important activities. So such people should not you know, lose, lose the blessings of the night. They, should, they shouldn't simply give up. Uh, so I'm going to mention some things that relate to these people as well as some additional benefits uh, for everybody else. Um, to perform the Salah of Maghrib, Isha and Fajr with Jama'ah in the Masjid, um, or in their homes in case of being sick. They should keep reciting the dhikr, particularly the one mentioned. Um, uh, sorry, um, there's another bit I need to uh, mention here actually. The, um, they should pray to Allah for their forgiveness and for their other objectives. So the kind of things that you want to achieve, you should ask Allah for these things. Even so, when you are in bed, um, and uh, there are some things we should not do on this night, which we must understand. Um, you know, some people, they might light up the masjid, people gather in, in large groups in the masjid. I mean, these are not things that have the evidence to say that this is the way we should perform it. Um, it's so important to understand this. And the Prophet wasallam he observed this night in total seclusion. He was not accompanied by anyone not even his favorite life companion, Aisha radiallahu anha. So all the nawafil that you do, you have to understand these are not in groups. This is things that you do to strengthen your relationship with Allah. MashaAllah. <laughs> এই রাতে তোমার করতে পারবা লাইলাতুল কদর রাতে সেম এমনি ভাবে লাইলাতুল কদর ও সেম যে কোন ধরনের নফল খাম করতে পারবা যার যে মনে যেটা ইচ্ছা বিশেষ করে মাগফিরাত আল্লাহর কাছে দোয়াটা একটু বেশি করে চাওয়া যাতে করে আল্লাহ আমরারে হেদায়েত দেন সমস্ত বিশ্বের হেদায়েত দেন দোয়ার এমনি আলাদা মর্যাদা বিশেষ রাতগুলোতে বা বিশেষ দিনগুলোতে দোয়ার তো আলাদা মর্যাদাই থাকে তাহলে বেশি করে দোয়াও করতে পারবা আর আমরা সময় কম আমি এগুলো এখন তর্জমা করার আমার মোটি সুযোগ নাই কিন্তু মোটামুটিভাবে এই রাত্রের সুযোগ আছে আমরা নফল হিসাবে কিছু এক্সট্রা আবাদত বন্দেগি করার এতে কোনো বাধা নাই আপত্তি নাই অন্যায় নাই বরং সব আর সব বিশেষ করে রমজানের আগে মাত্র দুই সপ্তাহ আগে এই রাতের সুযোগে রমজানের লাগে আমরা প্রস্তুতি নিতাম রমজানের লাগে আমরা অ্যালার্ট হইতাম হুঁশিয়ার হইতাম আর রমজানের প্ল্যান করতাম আমরা যে রমজানের আমরা সব কিছু 
سهری خوارات ره افتری خوار لیت ترابی نماز فرا اگر شب امر تاین تی بولر بهش خم خوره ایله که آخت که امر پلان خورتم ای برام زن رام را کوب شوند در باب زای ابعن رمضان امر کی باب تقوار زن خورتم فری حلال فود خیتم فری من خور که رمضان ور روز دینو روزا خاره خوی خواه دوا فانی پان خورا ایگولا بند ایگولا حلال جنیش بند ات الله بوزه ایده جتا حلال جنیش اکتا جو دی دینو الله رو حکم بند خورا لگه جتا حرام جتا آلیدی حرام اکتا تی که ار خوتو بشی باسه لگ بو جتا دین رایتی چوبش کنتا الله جتا حرام خوری راکی بیسون اکتا تی که تا امرا خوتو دوری باس تا لگ بو از ات باسه لگ بو رمضان و دینر بالا جشن لا حلال جنیش اسین اگر الله حرام خوری دیلاین این نام روزا جدی ای نام جدی روزا آی باسا نام تایل زیگل آشن حرام اگر تکی باسا تو آرو ضروری الله رسول الله صلی الله علیه و آله خویشان ملام یادا قول زور و عمل بهی فلای سر الله حاجت این یاد عطامه و شرابه ابو هرای رضی الله عنه حدیث خیلی جدی روزا را که تر باطل خام آر باطل خطا और तब और नए खोता और नए खाम सारे ना तो तो सारा दिन रुझारा कर जे बुखार तखार बा फानी ना खावार जे जे बुखार फका तखलो ऐते अल्लाह को नू लाभ होई बना रुझातो ऐसे आम्रे मुत्तकी बनाई बन लगे आम्रे शुंदर बनाई आर मानुषर अब्बास एक दिने शेष होए ना एक दिने मानुषर अब्बास सराय तफारना � روزا ما شو پرتک دین آذان دعایی با نماز لگی. کین تو سینتا خوری دعوا که ایدور دین و زن ایدور دین آذان نی. اگر تو کی تامرای خون آذان سرا کامو سرام را نماز فرت آفر. الله شر بول آلمان امر را ایبا به روزارا خر توفیق دان خرو که آر آگامی پروگرام دخرامان تون تخلو امر را شش خرم. السلام علیکم و رحمت الله و برکات.